Under the cover of darkness, a Brazilian black tarantula settles in for a meal. Huge, hairy, and fanged, tarantulas are the largest spiders in the world, sometimes reaching a foot in diameter. With a fearsome appearance and a painful bite to match, Roughly 800 tarantula species live around the globe. Their preference for warm climates makes the Amazon the perfect hunting ground. Most of them hunt for insects. But this Goliath tarantula measures nearly the size of a dinner plate. It searches for larger prey. The Goliath impales its quarry with one-inch fangs, injecting a dose of paralyzing neurotoxins. It renders the mouse unable to struggle or bite back. The tarantula's mouth is unequipped for chewing, so it regurgitates its own stomach juices over the victim, pre-digesting it, then sucking up the fluid. Tarantulas make their presence known with size and power. But a smaller, more lethal spider hunts in the Amazon, and its deadly reputation is well-deserved. The Brazilian Wandering Spider. The name comes from its nomadic lifestyle. The wandering spider doesn't dig a lair or spin a web. It is always on the move crawling throughout the low-lying areas of South America, from southern Venezuela to northern Argentina. This spider occasionally wanders into our neighborhoods, meaning it's likely to cross paths with us. It is infamous for biting when threatened or surprised. And it packs one of the biggest venomous punches of any spider in the world. In Brazil alone, two similar species account for nearly half of all reported spider bites. The bite packs a dose of venom more than twice as potent as the notorious black widows. The venom contains neurotoxins that immediately attack the nervous system causing the muscles that control the heart and breathing to shut down. The venom also contains serotonin that attacks the brain, causing tremors and intense pain. This potent weapon makes the wandering spider a hunter of incredible power. Able to kill insects, lizards, and mice, animals as large as the spider itself. Like a tarantula, it prefers to ambush its quarry, using the sensitive hairs on its body to detect vibrations from passing prey. Once it targets its victim, like this grasshopper, the outcome is certain. <laughs> 